guys welcome to rapturous house my name is tanya i hope you all are doing absolutely absolutely wonderful today's reading is going to be for my virgos i want to see so saturn is going retrograde on the 29th the 29th that saturday saturn is going retrograde it's normally about four four and a half months so this is going to be from June 29th to probably about November here. Saturn's going retrograde. Normally what happens in a retrograde is that things of the past come back in. Situations, certain people, you know, certain events, you know, things start to resurface, things starts to pop back up. There's such an energy that comes back in. So I want to see for the next four months when Saturn, because Saturn's coming in, it's going retrograde here from what I'm seeing. And we're going to see what's going to happen with you guys in your love life. Let's see what's coming in for you guys in love. Um, normally, I'm getting an energy more so of your love life, your friendships, um, seeing who's returning, what's going on, because it also brings forth certain obstacles, where if you may have had certain obstacles with certain people, certain challenges with certain people, um, things may pop back up. You know, some of you guys may feel like it's it's like there's always something like there may be somebody in your life, somebody come back into your life and it's a feeling of, oh, it's always something. Um, some of you guys, you may have felt isolated by someone here that may actually be returning to you in the next four months here when Saturn goes retrograde. Some of you guys, you may have found yourself a little lonely and a little depressed here. You may, you may find like that energy where things may start to get better, but then start certain feelings, certain emotions, they may start resurfacing again. You know, it also talks about a debt that has to be paid, a debt that must be paid. You know, this is whatever, whatever you put into the world, it comes back to you tenfold, tenfold. This is about your efforts, the efforts that you put in relationships, the efforts that you put in connections. We're going to get into your love life. What's going to happen when the Saturn goes retrograde here? Um, it also delays, Saturn also delays rewards until you've actually earned it. So this is about even in relationships, a lot of you guys, like if you're in something third party, know that there's karma here that's going to probably come back and kind of, there's going to be some gossiping. There's going to be a little upheaval. Anytime there's something third party and you have a retrograding um, karma, that type of energy is somewhat coming through. You know, you reap what you sow. That's what the next four months is going to be really and truly about when it comes to your love life. You guys reaping what it is that you sow. The efforts that you put into a situation is where you're going to get a return. So if you put little effort, if you're stubborn, you're going to, you're, you're going to, there's going to be a, a lot of mirroring effects here when Saturn goes retrograde. So let's see. I do want to thank you all. I want to thank you all for all your likes, all your shares, all of your comments. They're all greatly, greatly appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. That way you'll get notified anytime I upload any new video footages, but also that way I'm able to tug on your energy. All right, my loves. Let's see. Let's get into this energy. I do call on the Holy Spirit. I call on the white light that guides us. I call on the goddesses that gives us our strength and the angels that protect us. Let's see. All right. Let's see what's going on now for all my new subscribers, guys. Thank you. Thank you for joining me for all my returning subscribers, guys. I do love and appreciate every last one of you guys. For all my members, guys, thank you. Thank you for supporting the channel. You guys are so loved, so appreciated. I will be doing a members only reading this weekend for you guys. I'll be pulling some cards. We'll, I'll update you guys on the astrology for the month of July as well. I do wanna say I love every last one of you guys. So this is going to be for Saturn retrograde. For my Virgos, let's see what's going on. Because Saturn's actually retrograding in Aquarius, you know, and I feel like that's all about friendships, relationships. It's also, I feel like, because retrograding is also, you may see something inside of, in the world itself. 
this is something like cyber, cyber energy that's coming through. Some of you guys, you may hear certain things about cyber attacks. Some of you guys, there may be, you may hear where a company may have had a hack or something like that. Like that type of energy comes through in Saturn retrogrades. Um, yeah, so that's, it's going to be interesting. It's definitely going to be interesting. Set up, this is a love reading, so I'm not going to go all into it. <laughs> so we got clear waters. Look at that confirmation right timing and an opportunity here so there's an opportunity that's coming in for you guys this is all about the right time this is all about the timing saturn's bringing in some type of opportunity a clear vision i don't know why i feel like if you have felt isolated by someone this person is coming in to clear the air for you guys <coughs> Some of you guys also I'm getting like, if you felt like a connection was stronger than you thought or, or like a connection is not as strong as you thought, like there's definitely going to be a clear understanding that's coming through. There's confirmation, confirmation of somebody wanting relationships and somebody not wanting relationships, confirmation of what you already know, what you intuitively already know. So you guys will see that um, come Saturn retrograde for the, within the next four months. You guys will, there's clear visions here. You know, there's confirmations of what you intuitively know. You know, I'm also getting the right time. Whereas there, if there's been some delays or if there, there's been some opposition from someone here, this person is coming in. The timing, it's all about the timing. So you got somebody here that's coming towards you guys um, during Saturn retrograde, an opportunity, an opportunity in love, an opportunity in, for a relationship. Some of you guys, it's, op it's an opportunity for friendship. You know, whether, we, whether we're going to be friends or whether, whether they're going to be lovers, there's an opportunity here. So some of you guys, yes, this could be an opportunity of a, lo of a love life or an opportunity of a friendship. Beautiful energy. And then we have let it go. Release the past. So there's an opportunity here of you guys releasing the past. You know, I'm also getting forgiving. So some of you guys, there's someone here that you're going to be forgiving this person. This person is going to be forgiving you. But there's an opportunity to, to let go of the past, past pains, past hurts, past wounds. You know, this is like, let's let's let bygones be bygones and move forward here. I like the energy that's coming through with this retrograde for you guys. You know, and I do feel like there's a sense of stubbornness. You know, you may feel like certain things are incomplete. Some of you guys, you may feel right now, present moment where you don't have closure, true closure in a situation, in a relationship. But I feel like it's going to come back around so you can actually close things out properly or handle things accordingly. Because some of you guys, it's going to form a love relationship or it's going to form a friendship. This is about softening and moving forward here. There's a lot of movement that's happening in you guys' love life with this Saturn retrograde. A lot of movement that's happening. So show me. Ooh, immerse yourself. Training, learning, new hobbies and passions. So I see where you guys are going to be experiencing some training events. Some of you guys, there's you may be taking some classes to train yourself further. Strength training for some of you guys. There's some learning. I feel like this is like couple couple events. Partnering up with partnering up. Some of you guys may find yourself in the next four months hang, spending more time with your friends, spending more time with your lover, taking certain classes, learning certain things, picking up on new hobbies, new adventures, new passion. Some of you guys, you have a new relationship here that's coming in for, for you during Saturn retrograde. Absolutely beautiful energy. Show me more. Give me one more for my Virgos during Saturn retrograde. So we have the pink dolphin celebration, fun, unbridled joy and open heart here. Absolutely beautiful energy coming through for you guys. Absolutely beautiful because I feel like this is the karma. This is this is karmic debt. You know, what you put out into this world, you will get back tenfold. Some of you guys, this is fate. This is your fate here. You know, things are starting to align for you guys. So I do feel like within the next four months, you guys are going to start to feel things starting to align. This is because of your patience. This is definitely because of your patience, definitely because of your diligence. You know, if, if there's been some limiting beliefs, I feel like you guys are going to start releasing that. If there's been some restrictions between you and someone else, I feel like those restrictions will sub start to subside. 
You know, I feel like there's going to be more discipline, you know, massive energy coming through, but I'm also getting responsible parties. Like you guys dealing with somebody that's a responsible party, somebody that's going to, somebody that has that act right. There's a lot of energy here of act right after some type of isolation or a disconnect within a connection, within a relationship, within a friendship, massive energy. So let's see. Saturn retrograde for my Virgo spirit. Show me what's going on for my Virgos during Saturn retrograde spirit. So we have oof, entrapment, rescue, others involved here. So there's a saving grace here. You guys are dodging a bullet here in some type of way, shape, or form. Some type of way, shape, or form, you guys are dodging a bullet here during Saturn retrograde. You know, there's like an oops. It's like an oops, my bad. That type of energy that's coming through. Show me more. We have Verge about to reveal, confess. So somebody's about to find out here. Single current status available. So some of you guys, you will find out that somebody is now available here ready to move forward it was all about the timing for whoever this person is some of you guys there's an oops my bad situation where things will actually work out better than expected there are some things here that's going to work out better than expected i feel like there's going to be some clearing of the air some open and honest conversations where someone's going to want to actually kind of they're going to be confessing there's going to be some confessions you know, there's some positives and there's some negatives in the confession, but still, I feel like it's allowing for movement here. You know, I also feel like there's a, there's an energy here of you guys needing to release certain things of the past. So you guys needing to forgive, you guys needing to soften, stop being so stubborn. If you have been isolating yourself, I feel like there's such an energy, such a vibe here about you guys kind of coming out of that. Because that's limit that's it's limiting you. It's limiting a relationship from the for the potential of growth here. You know, massive energy. Show me more, spirit for my Virgos. We have divine masculine. So you have a divine being here, all up in your energy. Yeah. Irreconcilable differences. So you guys got somebody here that you have you were beefing with. You're beefing with this person. This person's coming back around. This is a divine being. You've been beefing with this person, projected future days, weeks, and months. So this person's coming back around. Some of you guys, you definitely have a divine masculine here that's coming back around. Show me. Again, intervention, rescue, others involved. I feel like you guys, there's a massive protection here. Again, karmic debt, debt that must be paid. The, whoever this is that's coming back around to you guys during Saturn retrograde, this is karma. This is a karmic individual. There is a debt here. You know, whatever this person is learning, it's, it's a lesson to be learned for the rest of this person's life. Whatever this person's learning, even for yourself, whatever you're learning during Saturn retrograde, it's a lesson that you're learning for life here. Massive energy. Show me more, spirit. So we have pressure cooker, rage, ready to explode. Wow. Desire, lust, sexual chemistry. So you guys got somebody here that there's, there's someone that's coming back. And you may not want to hear that. You really and truly may not want to hear that. There's someone that's coming back around here. Some of you guys do be careful because you may get somebody that'll come back and try to entrap you. Somebody that may come back in and try to pull on your heartstrings. You know, but this is somebody here that they have something to say to you. And it's, it's bothering this person that you've isolated them. It's definitely bothering this person. Show me more, spirit. Show me more for my Virgo's gossip. Petty, jealous, and envy. I told you, you got that Saturn retrograde. You guys got some friends. You got some ex-lovers here. 
You got certain people that's intertwined with certain people that you used to be intertwined with that's coming in for the, I don't want to say they're coming in for the win, but they're definitely coming in to cause a disturbance. Definitely coming in to cause a disturbance, you know, with that Saturn retrograde, it talks about obstacles coming back around. It comes in to remind you of how disciplined you are, how responsible you are. It comes in like a storm to test, to test your gangsta, you know, to test your willpower, to test how responsible you are, how disciplined you are, you know, how how you have transformed. So I feel like for the next four months, you guys will definitely be tested. Your willpower will definitely be tested here. And for a lot of you guys, it's going to be in the way of someone, a friend or a, a lover here that comes back around. Definitely a friend or a lover here that's going to come back around. Show me more spirit. Yeah. Searching online, looking for info or records here. So this is somebody here that's trying to come up with a game plan, lost, ghosted, blocked, cut off. You guys get that in your energy a lot where people that you have cut off, you've ghosted, you've blocked these people. They find, they try to find a way back to you. And I feel such a massive energy here. Whereas you guys are trying to let go and releasing the past. That's what you guys are being called to work on during Saturn retrograde. Focus on some new hobbies and your passions. Don't miss out on opportunities that's right in front of you though. I see a lot of fun. Stay with an open heart here. There is someone here that's coming back around though. I want to know about this entrapment. Show me this entrapment. Let's use some tarot. Because I feel like this is not something that's going to actually come to fruition. I don't think so. I don't feel that. Show me this entrapment for my Virgos during Saturn retrograde spirit. So we have the five of wands. See that? This is like, no, this is not that five of wands came out in the reverse. Like, I don't want no drama. I don't want no conflict. You know, this is like, I'm not doing this with you. So someone can try, someone can try to win over your person, win over a situation here, but this is not, they're not getting through the front door. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy, as I saw 1717 on the clock. You know, this is the, again, there's a warning here <laughs> because some of you guys, there's somebody here, this person has money. And this person would take care of whatever they were to, if there was a pregnancy, if there was a relationship in some type of way, shape or form, this person would take care of whatever responsibilities they have. Yes, we see that. And I do see what this person wants, no competition, but I just don't know if this person is going to go about handling things the right way initially, because it definitely gives me an energy of someone here that wants what they want. And kind of, this is, you know, King of Pentacles tends to go after what they want. They won't stop until they actually accomplish what it is they want. King of Pentacles, strong Capricorn energy, but Virgo Taurus Capricorn energy. But this also is ruling of Saturn. Again, Saturn retrograding. Some of you guys, you have an earth sign that's coming back towards you. This could have been somebody that was involved with someone else or in a sticky situation, someone else in this person coming back around. Truly, truly coming back around. So show me this verge. So we have the star about to reveal, confess here. So you guys got a wish here being granted. You want to know what's up, you're going to find out. You know, you want to know how somebody feels, you're going to find out. You want to know if somebody's into you, you're going to find out. You know, this talks about your wishes, your dreams, your goals, your faith your faith in something higher, your spirituality. You know, this is, I feel like you guys are going to, there's, there's a verge of a confession here. Some of you guys, you're dealing with somebody that's in the public's eye or this person's a celebrity here. Um, I also feel like someone is confessing what they really and truly want. What's their big dream? What's their big wish here? Yeah, show me this intervention. So we have the eight of swords here. Some of you guys there, 
somebody may actually end up in jail. Somebody may actually end up in jail or somebody may be, there may be some type of situation where someone's stuck, but them being stuck in whatever the situation is, is for your highest and your greatest good. It is. It is. I see someone here wanting to reconcile with you. This person wants to reconcile with you. Some of you guys, you may hear from certain friends, family members, exes, where they're actually involving other people in the mix. Why? Because they want to reconcile. This is like you guys getting an unexpected invitation only because somebody's going to actually be there. And they're calling in reinforcement. Yeah. Now, this person is a divine masculine. Show me this divine masculine for my Virgo spirit. So we have the five of cups. Somebody that feels at a loss. Somebody that feels at a loss. Two of cups. They feel like you're their soulmate. This person wants a relationship with you. This person wants a relationship with you, Ten of Swords, but this is the same person that did you wrong. Whoever this person is that wants this relationship with you, you know, this person did do you wrong, though. This is somebody that's very good looking, somebody very abundant, somebody that gets a lot of attention, but they still nonetheless did you wrong, and this person is grieving over the loss of you, and this person is coming back around. Tell me more about this person. The devil, Capricorn energy, three of pentacles. This could be somebody that you work with, but this person's addicted to you and obsessed. Strong Capricorn energy coming through. Saturn retrograde is definitely going to be in full effect for people coming back around for you. For people, friends coming back around, friends with benefits, relationships, you know, People are from your love life. Some of you guys, there's been some energy. There's some third party energy here. You know, this is some affairs. Some of you guys, there's some gossiping around affairs. You know, there's certain affairs here that's coming back around. Certain attachments that's coming back around. Massive energy. Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Some of you guys, it's your ex, your ex-husband, your ex-baby mama, your ex-baby daddy, somebody that you were in a relationship with. And here this person come back around and they have this newfound, oh, I want to do this, that type of energy. So show me more, spirit. Show me more. Show me this pressure cooker for my Virgos during Saturn retrograde. The chariot, look at that, ready to explode, ready to move things forward. This is like telling me somebody's going to be popping up here, cancer energy coming through, Wanting forward movement, travel, Page of Swords. Page of Swords talks about learning and investigating. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, energy. You got somebody here that's watching you. This person is coming back around. Like this person is watching you heavy. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Cancer, energy. This person's watching you heavy and expect a return from this person. You can expect this person traveling to you. That some, some of you guys, you got somebody here. This person's at a distance from you and this person's trying to figure out a way. Seven of Wands. Hmm. Why is the Seven of Wands here? Ace of Wands. This person is extremely attracted and you have somebody new here. Mm. Somebody's trying to figure out why you, this person's ready to explode. This person may rage out whoever this person is. Because they're trying to figure out why you've put up boundaries with them, why you've blocked them, why you're not fighting for this anymore. And you're going to hear from this person. You're going to hear from this person. This person wants a new opportunity here. This person is highly attracted to you. Show me more. Show me this gossip for my Virgo spirit. Eight, nine of cups. Wish fulfillment. Wish fulfillment here. There's a lot of somebody's talking like whoever is coming back around to you. This is somebody that talks about the sex between you and them. Four of Pentacles, they're still holding on to you. This person is this person feels like you're their wish fulfillment. This person's doing a lot of talking. Some of you guys, you got some friends here. They're talking a lot about your personal life, your personal relationships, 
you know, your sex life, your romantic life. You have some petty friends here that's doing a lot of talking. But I'm also seeing somebody here that you've already been intimate with, this person doing a lot of talking about your sex escapades with their friends here. This person's still holding on to you. This person dreams about you. This person dreams about you. This person cries, some of you guys. This person thinks about you a lot at night. The hermit, you have withdrawn yourself from this person. And I'm also getting, again, I'm telling you guys, a lot of you guys are dealing with an earth sign. A lot of you guys are dealing with an earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This, you may find this person to be a little petty. You know, a little jealous, a little envious because you because you're not dealing with them or because you're not giving them what they want. Yeah, show me more. Show me this searching for my Virgos during Saturn retrograde. Ooh, Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Someone here is coming towards you very passionately. Knight of Swords. Some of you guys are in between two people. You got one person coming towards you for your goodies and you got one person coming towards you because they want to talk to you. Some of you guys are doing some online dating. Like you may be doing a lot of online dating. I'm also going to give you out a warning sign here that some of these people might be a little crazy. <laughs> like some of these people might be a little crazy here. But with that Knight of Wands, there's a lot of online activity here. And I see where you guys will find yourself caught in the middle of two different, in, two different people during Saturn retrograde. And you have one person's finding out about another person via social media here. I see this person chasing after you guys. Yeah. Yep. Four of Pentacles again, holding on. They can't let go. Seven of Cups. You guys got a lot of options here in love. And a lot of options and a lot of temptations. You guys need to choose wisely. You guys will definitely need to choose wisely. So tell me, Spirit, what is this Saturn retrograde bringing in new for my Virgos? Ooh, the Emperor, Aries energies. You guys are bossing up. You guys have an opportunity to boss up here. Definitely an opportunity to boss up. Some of you guys, you have a father figure here that's coming towards you. The Emperor, you know, some of you guys, there's a new opportunity here that's coming in the world. Some of you guys have an opportunity to travel. You could be taking a trip overseas. You could be, you could definitely be taking a trip overseas. Or some of you guys, you could be traveling for work. Show me more. What's new coming in? The moon here. Secrets are coming to light. Cancer energy. Six of swords. But it's going to free you. It's going to move. It's going to get things moving. There's some secrets here that's coming out. Strong cancer Pisces energy. There are some things that's hidden from you that's coming to light here. Someone's expressing their feelings and they're expressing their emotions here. Six of Swords, able to move on to karma waters. Unexpectedly, Ace of Swords, a lot of clarity and a lot of honest conversations. A lot of clarity and a lot of on honest conversations is coming in for you guys in love. Show me more. Ace of Swords, see that? Again, a lot of clarity, a lot of honest conversation. Knight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, energy. You will find that someone is chasing after you heavily on your tail. The world here. Someone wants a new start with you. Someone wants a new start with you. This is, again, letting bygones be bygones. You know, right. this is all about the right timing. Somebody feels like the timing is right between you and them now. They want to release the past. They want forgiveness and they want to be able to move things along to move forward and some of you guys all your focus is on is moving forward past someone here you see immersing yourself a lot of immersing yourself in trainings learning something new picking up new hobbies and your passions new passions here that's coming in for you guys and then we have celebration fun unbridled joy and open-hearted i see such a beautiful energy for you guys during saturn retrograde i do but in your love life, I see where there is someone that is coming back in. I definitely feel I definitely feel like there's someone here that's coming back in here. Massive energy. 
All right, my loves, that is what I have for you guys. If any of this resonates, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Guys, know that I love and appreciate every last one of you guys. Until next time. Bye, guys.